Edgar J. Justice was born in Missouri and has said that he left the farm for two reasons, and putting up hay was both of them. Between 1943 and 1946, he served in the U.S. Air Force, both in the South Pacific and Japan. He obtained the rank of captain. In 1946, he earned a flight home by converting General Douglas MacArthur's yacht from gasoline to diesel power. After the war, he returned to finish his education at Georgia Institute of Technology, and he earned a degree in mechanical engineering. In 1943, E.J. married his childhood sweetheart, Lula Ann. They were married for 45 years and raised five children. Those children have since produced nine grandchildren. Family was important to E.J., however, there was never a family vacation that didn't also include a side trip to a paper mill. E.J. began his career at Fairbanks Morse in Beloit, Wisconsin in 1947. In 1950, he went to work for Beloit Corporation and he retired in 1984. He directed the company's worldwide R&D programs in pulp, stock, and papermaking technology. With over 100 patents to his name, E.J. Justice made significant contributions to the advancements in paper machine design and performance. These designs illustrate that his philosophy of functional simplicity is key to successful engineering and that a logical solution can be found to any problem if the engineer uses his education and abilities to think out the most effective answer. E.J. was adamant about the value of education and he believed it was the best hands-on experience. Because he appreciated the value of having been a co-op student while at Georgia Tech, he began a co-op program at Beloit Corporation. For him, the experience was similar to a medical internship. At his retirement in 1984, E.J. is joined by friends and associates who were key persons in his career. He felt that through their assistance and trust, they allowed him to do what he did best. Shown here are Ebby Neese, former owner and president of Beloit Corporation, Jan Bergstrom, a professional colleague and personal friend, and Harry Moore, former president and chairman of Beloit Corporation. Besides his passion for the paper industry, E.J. was an avid hunter and gun collector. He's shown here on a hunting trip to Botswana, Africa. He was an accomplished runner in high school and followed track and field throughout his life. He attended the Olympic Games from 1956 to 1972. In recognition of his many accomplishments, E.J. Justice received several professional honors, including Tappy Fellow, Tappy Engineering Division Award, Tappy Gunner Nicholson Gold Medal Award, and Georgia Technical College of Engineering Hall of Fame for Distinguished Alumni.